We saw your original journey on 16 and Pregnant with your daughter Carly and her adoptive parents. Mm -hmm. um, Tyler recently posted a photo of Carly saying how much he misses her. Mm -hmm. What is your relationship like with Carly and her parents? Um, we're actually in the process right now. I've been, you know, talking to her parents, trying to um, set up a visit for this year. So we talk on the phone and when we have time, you know, we try to get together and have face-to-face -face visits and stuff. Um, but we text pictures all the time and talk on the phone and emails and I send her Christmas presents, Easter basket. That's Teen Mom OG star Caitlin Lowell Balterra giving me an update on her daughter Carly's adoptive parents. That's just one of the storylines you can expect on the new season of Teen Mom OG, premiering tonight on MTV. The show's our Toyota People pick of the day. And when I recently sat down with Caitlin and Amber Portwood, they opened up about their battle with mental health and how they are coping today. Watch this. I'm doing very well two years out, you know, since birth. So um, I'm doing actually, I feel really good. I do. I definitely, I had a panic attack this morning, but I worked through it. It's just knowing, you know, the things that you have to do to work through it. But um, yeah, I'm doing way better. And do you both have specific coping mechanisms when you are feeling that anxiety? I've dealt with anxiety since I was young and that's been like my thing my whole life. But I also have, um, I was recent, recently diagnosed with borderline personality. Um, and I've had bipolar, um, I was diagnosed with that uh, probably when I was about 18, 19. So uh, being that, you know, having all of those things, it, it's, it's really hard and it's hard to cope with. And for me, I see there's a difference, like, you know, with depression and then having like a mental disorder depression because it literally comes on and stays no matter what you do until it's done. So if you're on medication for it, that's the only way to really help improve. So it's, I'm, I'll be on medication for the rest of my life. So it's, I mean, something that I really struggle with, like really badly, um, especially with the new borderline, which I figured. Um, but I'm doing good now because I'm on a certain medications now. And um, now I finally feel normal and healthy and I think clearly and before I was just groggy and depressed. Hey YouTube, don't forget to like this video and leave a comment if you enjoyed it. And for more people now, click on the subscribe button down here. And check out more great video right now by clicking on one of these links.